In the television series The Big Bang Theory, the main character Dr. Sheldon Cooper, as a result of mental underachievement, develops luminescent fish as a nightlight substitute. However, the idea and extensive sales plans are dismissed as lunatic by those around him. Anyway, you sometimes have to follow up on lunatic ideas, so let's make an artificial glow fish with the help of chemistry. We heat 100 milliliters of distilled water in a beaker and dissolve 3 grams of sodium carbonate and 0.3 grams of luminol in it. Sodium carbonate helps the luminol to dissolve in water. Then we add 1.3 grams of agar. We continue to heat, stirring constantly. As soon as the solution boils, we remove the beaker from the flame. The hot solution is carefully poured into prepared silicon molds with fish motifs. The ones I use are actually molds for resin and you can get them for a few bucks on Amazon. The thin layer of aqueous liquid that forms on the gel surface, also called cinerasis, will make demolding easy later. After cooling, put the filled molds in the freezer for half an hour. Carefully remove the frozen fish from the mold and place them on a piece of paper towel. The two fish are then gently transferred to a beaker. To another beaker containing 90 milliliters of distilled water, we add 1 gram of potassium ferrous cyanide. After the potassium ferrous cyanide is dissolved, we add 10 milliliters of 10% hydrogen peroxide solution. The room is now darkened and the potassium ferrocyanide hydrogen peroxide solution is slowly added to the beaker containing the fish. The chemiluminescence is not particularly bright, but it lasts longer than usual. This is because the potassium ferrocyanide hydrogen peroxide solution penetrates very slowly into the agar mixed with luminol. When we add the potassium ferrocyanide hydrogen peroxide solution to an ordinary sodium carbonate luminol solution, the chemiluminescence is very intense but soon fades. Anyway, at least the luminol based artificial luminous fish don't seem to be suitable as a nightlight substitute. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to hit the like and subscribe buttons. See you next time.